So what did I learn in Castlevania? What did I learn in Castlevania? What did I learn in Castlevania? Chivalry isn't dead. I learned that there's this family of, I don't know, career vampire hunters. Simon Belmont is a really good friend of mine. There's a Belmont. And though he might be a bit vain, blonde dudes are the most useful. He comes from a very prestigious family who happens to know their way well around <laughs> just about anything. Simon, Richter, Alucard apparently. Man, sometimes it reminds me I've got some really cool friends. Friendship. So they go around doing what most vampire slaying families would do. Skeletal motocross, bro. Play vampires with whips. See, Simon and his family all have this whip that gets passed down from generation to generation in heirloom. Another various assortment of bondage equipment. And it helps to, you know, have a backpack that can hold just about any possible thing you could ever need. They all really look like they're in bondage. Holy water. All the leather. Throwing knives. All the whips. Axes. It's just... Good. Bad. It's kind of creepy. Sometimes it's a little of both. Simon Belmont's a really cool guy. Greatness sometimes gets overlooked. Talking about a man who's come toe-to-toe -to -toe with death. He looks at himself in the mirror. And managed to battle it off himself. He smiles at his own visage. Who has defeated Dracula. He combs his hair. Dracula's not just some spooky vampire from Transylvania. Only as narcissistically as he looks at the mirror. A being so powerful, even the devil is scared of him. He's the strongest. This thing is this overlord of pure evil. He's the smartest. And a man takes him down. He's brilliant in every way. It shows you that no matter what, if you set your mind to it, you could indeed have complete control over oneself. And don't look back, you can accomplish anything. You just can't get the girl. The safety hazards of stairs. Their worlds go up, they go down, they go left, they go right. You may even have to double back through everything. That I need to hit the Stairmaster. Sometimes they'll like whip the bricks up the wall. Dude's a regular old Boy Scout, no wonder. For some reason, fried chicken is just ready to consume. He just eats chicken he finds in the wall. In the walls. He probably knows whether he can tell if it's got salmonella or not. Patience. Something, something. Horrible night tappers. Look ahead before I act. I wouldn't doubt if everybody in the Belmont clan family that just goes around slaying vampires is a mandatory Eagle Scout. Monotony. I really am the real sign of Belmont. Greatness does walk among us. It has an amazing fighting game on the Wii. That's determination. Castlevania Judgment? Oh man. That's some gall. Castlevania Judgment. Let me tell you, dear viewer. Oddly, that is what I learned in Castlevania. That's what I learned in Castlevania. That's what I learned in Castlevania. Hey everybody, it's The Metal, and thanks for watching the video. I'd like to thank both of the guests in this episode. You should all be familiar with Lord Pattaya by now, but did you know he makes some excellent combo videos? You should head over to his channel. I'll put a link right there for you to check it out. And for our other guests being his first time, I'll let him fill you in on the rest. Hello, people. I go by Johnny Burns, and that's B-U-R-N-E-S. The E is for extra pretentiousness. And you can visit my channel and see all of the various things I like to discuss, because I like to show how to get the most out of games and perhaps show the light and how to possibly enjoy things like Resident Evil 6, Castlevania 64, Street Fighter 1, and maybe uh, this little game here I'll get to. But uh, you can also see me interview various people, such as Stuttering Craig from ScrewAttack, Mega Ran, and the great John St. John, as well as Angry Joe and a few other fine guests that I'm very appreciative for joining me, and I hope you will join me again soon. Thanks. Take care. Adventure Rebirth taught me to pray. Pray that my Wii doesn't die, because I don't know how much longer that's going to be available to download.